All right. It is Monday, March 9th, 2020 at 2.28 a.m. All right, guys, let's take a look quickly here. All right, there was a quake alert. A magnitude 5.6 earthquake strikes off the coast of Northern California three hours ago. So let's take a look here quickly at the USGS. Zoom in to the area. There's been multiple earthquakes here. There was a 5.8 downgraded to a 5.6, uh, a 2.6, a 2.5, a 2.9, and a 2.5. So there's been multiple 2.5s, a 2.9, a 2.6, and a 5.8 downgraded to a 5.6 earthquake by California. So off the coast here of California, it's uh, being active in the northwestern part. All right, let's take a look at another story here. All right, guys, so Dabu777 was reporting that Port of Los Angeles taking substantial hits expected volumes to plunge to 15%. So the Port of Los Angeles that accepts the shipping containers that pretty much um, gives all of our sh goods to California and everything all the shipping you know you're gonna buy something in the store it's delivered by shipping container to the stores alright so this is pretty much important if the port of Los Angeles is taking substantial hits so the people in the Los Angeles area and in that western coast and wherever you know people are getting goods from this area if the if this the plunge of volume of you know the volume of things there being delivered plunges it means that there won't be any goods there to sell or to buy here we go it says APA estimates that IQ cargo volume of US seaports will fall by 20 percent due to coronavirus the LA port volumes fell 25 percent in February and South Carolina port projects 15% and 20% declines in April and March respectively so the South Carolina and the ports in uh, Los Angeles usually they're stacked you see how high let me see if I can zoom in usually they're stacked you look how high these stacks of containers shipping containers are alright so apparently um, I came across this video by Ice Age Farmer that says empty ports supply chain breaks so apparently in her video she says that there's barely any shipping containers there's a couple but the rest of the time it's empty so that's in LA the shipping ports are empty this is a warning sign for me if there are no shipping containers coming in that means no goods are coming in and there's going to be a shortage at the stores that's the message there's going to be a possibility of a shortage of items coming in so just wanted to give a heads up to you guys for you guys who are preppers or for you guys who um would like to keep an eye on the news that's a possibility the shortage of goods the lack of items at stores because they're not coming in from China or from uh, any of the other ports. Alright guys, hit like and subscribe for more video updates and more uh, earthquake video updates and see you guys next time. God bless.